You are looking at Dr. Joel Furman, the author of Eat to Live, the Revolutionary Formula for Fast and Sustained Weight Loss. Good to see you, Doctor. Great to be here. Real quick, you were saying before we get on the air, your niche in the diet or the um, food-related uh, world is what? Well, a lot of people out there don't want a gimmick or a, something that's going to have them lose weight in an unsafe manner. They want to know what's optimal, what's going to have them drop weight the quickest, the safest, while at the same time lowering the risk of chronic diseases, reducing cancer risk, have them live longer, have them be more youthful and feel better, and get off medication, get off the high blood pressure medications, get off the cholesterol-lowering drugs. Is there a diet that can actually reverse diabetes quickly and get off, stop the medications within a month or two? And the answer is yes. If people want to know that there is an optimal, safest way to lose lots of weight, almost effortlessly, reduce cholesterol by 33%, more powerful than cholesterol-lowering medication can, and do it in a way using anti-cancer foods, that's the niche. The niche I occupy is where people want to learn what's the best, safest, most healthiest way to do it. Describe it. Well, it's a diet. Because you're against some things. I told you that before we got out here, right. here's, I'll tell you what, folks, we tape on a Saturday, we tape all of our shows, not all of them, but like 10 in a day. Mm -hmm. And I have to tell you, I said to you, I had my cereal this morning. Right. I thought it was Nutrigrain, right? I had my Nutrigrain cereal. I threw some raisins in there, had skim milk. And then I said to you, because we're taping this at 11 o'clock in the morning, and I said I had my balance bar right before. And you said, that's bad because it's processed food? Most, about 90% of the calories you just took in were from processed foods. In other words, the, let's describe what most Americans eat for a minute. Americans eat 40% of calories from animal products. Half of that 40% is dairy. That's what Americans eat. Now, dairy is the number one contributor of saturated fat I in the American diet. I said skim milk. Okay. Well, I'm just... Is that better? Yeah, definitely okay, better. Go ahead. Okay. So Americans eat 40% from animal products, and then we eat 51% from processed foods. Pasta, bread, bagels, English muffins, salad oil, olive oil, canola oil, cottonseed oil, donuts, cookies, rice cakes, soft drinks, puff cereals, breakfast bars, pretzels, you know, Cheerios, those kind of foods, right? That's the American diet, leaving over... Good stuff. Well, those foods, see, let's review this, because that's only 4.5% of calories in the American diet from fruits and vegetables and beans. Those foods, the fruits and vegetables and beans, these natural, healthy foods, are the foods that have all the phytochemicals and nutrients in it that prevent cancer, right? So that animal products and processed foods don't have in them vitamin E, vitamin C, vitamin K, folate, fiber, vitamin, vitamin K, bioflavonoids, beta carotene, gamma carotene, cryptoxanthine. Um, oh, wait a minute, doctor, I'm taking vitamins. I'm taking a multivitamin. Why do I need to do everything you're saying? I've got my multivitamin. Well, because all these anti-cancer nutrients are found in natural foods. They haven't met the inside of a vitamin pill bottle yet. Most of them haven't even, even discovered yet. Compare what you can get in a big multivitamin. Maybe you can get, let's say, if you're lucky, you can find a vitamin that maybe will have 400 micrograms of lutein or lycopene. What does that mean? I can't follow Lutein that. or lycopene is a carotenoid that has powerful anti-cancer effects. Carotenoid? Carotenoid, like a beta-carotene type substance. There's about 400 different carotenoids. I heard the juice man talk about that.